And you're like, what are we looking at, a construction site? But we are here at Walt Disney World on the Seven Seas Lagoon. We are at the Polynesian right now on the dock. This is our ride pulling in. We're gonna take a boat over to the Magic Kingdom. You can see the Contemporary and Bay Lake Tower in the distance there, Space Mountain and Tron, the Grand Floridian. And next to the Poly, in between the Grand Floridian, and there's the Wedding Chapel, is the new tower that everyone's very nervous about. Hopefully it's beautifully themed. We're gonna stay optimistic and positive, but it is gigantic. And uh, yeah, let's hope it. It gets nicely themed but yeah you can see right there i guess the base floor two three four five six seven eight nine ten floors uh on the main tower so we'll see what happens here's our ride pulling up it's gonna be a nice day the magic game it is a hot one today uh going to be over 90 degrees but i wanted to be with all of you it's a great day for a great day if you could do me the big favor please hit that like button it really does help Helps the algorithm, makes me happy, gets me excited. And if you're new, consider subscribing. We're so excited for all the new subscribers. Thanks if you're brand new. Thanks so much for being here with us and checking it out. We do fun stuff like this all the time, whether it's Disney World or going to other theme parks like Universal, SeaWorld, Gatorland, fun spot, Old Town. And uh, we do a bunch of travel and tourism stuff as well including uh coming up for the first two weeks of june we'll be on a road trip up and down the east coast <clears throat> how's it going just me oh, sure you got it rosa this is one of my favorite boats to take over to the magic kingdom i love the little boat you're right on the water a little skiff. Get the open air. Sorry, we had a little bit of a late start today. I uh, had a couple of things run a little bit longer than I expected, and then I'm uh, the reason I'm here at the Polynesian uh, is I have friends who are staying here and uh, caught up with them and then I caught up with some other people. Just got phone calls that I didn't expect to get. They got away from me. I wanted to rope drop this today. <laughs> We're going to get there uh, just before noon. Yeah, we are. Let's say hi. Where are you from? North Carolina. Oh, what part? Raleigh. Nice. Shout out to Raleigh, North Carolina. Look at this. I got my own private vessel. This is fancy. I'm going to sit in the back of the boat. Look at this. King of the castle, king of the castle. You know, you used to get excited when you get your own Disney bus and take pictures and get all excited, but getting your own Disney boat, now this is the life. So the plan is we're gonna do uh, some rides today, maybe some shows, maybe a cavalcade or a parade. We're gonna see what the day takes us, but we're gonna do a bunch of fun stuff. It's been too long since we've been at the Magic Kingdom together. Although, if you want to see some Magic Kingdom magic in short form, uh, we started our Ted Lasso shorts here on the channel. We'll be releasing those uh, every other day during the week uh, as Ted Lasso wraps up its final season. A few episodes left. I think we have about 20 to 30 Ted Lasso shorts. So we're going to be dropping them every other day. I hope you're enjoying them. If you are, make sure you're liking them. Share them if you think they're funny. Thanks. I'll watch everyone on the boat. I'll hold down this end. <laughs> All right. Arms and legs inside, everybody. Seas Lagoon, a man-made lagoon, believe it or not, which connects to the natural lake, Bay Lake, 
which is where Ford Wilderness and Wilderness Lodge are. They're off that lake. So Bay Lake, over a thousand years old. This, they dug out, took all this land to put Magic Kingdom up on the second story so they can have those utilidors underneath so that way we don't see any of the magic happening underneath. We just enjoy the magic up top. And with that gradual incline, you don't even realize it, but when you walk into the Magic Kingdom, you're already on the second story. All right, let's enjoy the boat. I'm gonna say hi to some people in the chat. My man Pete Stummy, so I got the wave down pat. Donna, I would just like to cruise around on that boat all day. I agree, I love this boat, one of my favorites. Just got Disney, what's going on? Pete, I'm glad you guys are liking the Ted Lasso stuff. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. If you haven't seen it, it's such a great show. Very wholesome, especially if you like Disney and, you know, just good old quality fun. There is some language in it, but the messaging and the overall theme of the show is very positive and loving. But there's a couple bad words if you have young kiddos. Uh, let's say hi to a bunch of people. I'm going to go up to the top and work my way down real quick. But good morning to Jamie Philip Hone. Stephen Noon, Mel, what's going on? David Lung, Robert D is over at uh, Universal Studios Islands of Adventure. I'm going to try and swing over there later if I can. Yeah, beautiful day out here. Robert nailed it. The, the clouds look painted in the sky. There is a nice breeze out on the water. It's warm when you're standing still. I'm not going to lie, but on the water right now, it's not bad at all. Once again, if you're just joining us, please hit that like button. Help me out. Uh, it would mean so much, and I really appreciate it. We also have an awesome Discord. Uh, the reason we're going to Magic Kingdom today is because the Discord voted on it. If you want to jump on our Discord, it's completely free. It's easy to do. Uh, you can do it from your cell phone, computer, laptop, tablet, whatever you want to do. I recommend using your real name or your YouTube name so we know who is who. But great to see that community growing over there. It is just a fantastic place on the Internet, which is so rare to hear. <laughs> It's just wholesome. It's great. It's I'm using the word wholesome a lot today. Uh, it's an awesome spot. So go check out the Discord. Hi, Shelly. Jeff, what's going on? Yes, I am back. We're trying to go full throttle. We had a nice long stream uh, just about five hours on Monday over at Hollywood Studios. I was going to be live at Epcot yesterday, but we had some phone issues, so that didn't happen yesterday. So I said, let's get out and get a morning stream in today. Uh, I was up at 5, like I said, the morning just got crazy. I went from like, all right, I'll have a nice easy morning to uh, a little bit of a crazy morning. But we made it here before noon. That's all that matters. And it, the magic goes all day long. Good morning, Peaches. Great to see Dawn. So Daniel, the Tomorrowland Traveler, he just dropped a new video if you uh, want to go check out the Jungle Cruise on his channel. Jordan Garrett in the house. What's up, Jordan? Mike and Courtney are here. They're watching from work. Thanks, guys. Mike, I saw your text while I was driving and in the rental car. I don't know how to write back, So, but I'll write you back as soon as the stream is over. I did not see last night's Ted Lasso. I'm waiting to watch with Lauren tonight. I, hi, Sarah. Good morning. I don't put the wrong time to build anticipation. I really think I'm going to be here at that time. And then things just happen. I should make it later. And I've done that before. And then I get here early. And I'm like, well, now I don't want to start early. People don't know I'm starting. And I got to put a time out there so I can promote it and give everybody a little bit of notice. And then one thing leads to another. It's craziness. But that's what you get, right? These are live videos. That's how you know it's live. We're just going for it. Why are we going all the way out here? We're gonna make a big turn. And here comes the big turn. Yeah, there we go. I was like, uh, did we add stops that I don't know about? So this line that I'm on now goes from the Magic Kingdom to the Grand Flow to the Polynesian and then back here. So this triangle of one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three all day long. And then there's another boat that will take you over to uh, Wilderness Lodge and a separate boat that'll take you to Fort Wilderness and another boat that'll take you to the TTC, those giant, the big ones. More like a ship. Let me head back up to where we were, try to get some of this chat. I want to make sure I give love to everybody. 
my gosh, that great to see Pete here. Andrew, what's going on? Andrew C in the house. Siva, Coda, David, Nico the Greco is here. Izzo in the house. Izzo's got another great channel as well. Francois, one of our newer subscribers, welcome back. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. Dawn, I'm with you. Trying to stay optimistic about what we're calling the Polyday Inn, which is that construction next to the Polynesian. Matthew Kent, good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Uh, I'm, I hope I don't say your name wrong, but I'm going to say it. Uh, I'm going to call you HK, but thanks for all the love in the chat. I'm going to use your initials because I don't want to botch your name. Andy in the house. What's up, Andy? Michael Riley is here at the park. Hopefully we can run into Michael. Say hi to Michael today. Great to see Lynette is here. Hi, Lynette. Big shout out to uh, Bill and Lynette. We love them. Steve Marmelstein, what's going on? So no one else saw the boat except for me and Roseanne. We got a private ride today. How wonderful is that? Hello, I'm going to say your name is Arjun or Arjun or Arhun. But uh, what's going on? We are headed to the Magic Kingdom. Uh, if Peter Pan's got a decent weight, we'll try it. It's also a very dark ride, but we'll try our best. We try not to wait more than 20 minutes for anything because it can get a little boring watching a live stream with somebody in line. Amanda, hello from Brazil. Brazil in the house. Hiadros, what's going on? Says, woo, Carney stream, and we're on a boat. Jess, thanks for joining the Discord. I th think you'll enjoy it. <laughs> Hiadros, I agree. He says, I always like the no dancing signs on Disney boats. That's great. Here we go. We made it. Thanks for the lovely ride. It's the best Uber somebody could ask for. There you go. <laughs> you too, Michael. Here we go into the Magic Kingdom. What's going on, Mark Mueller? Jen is here. What's going on, Jen? Here we go. I got to aim you at the ground because you cannot film security. Have a good day. Here we are. The most magical place on earth. We're about to be walking right down the middle of Main Street, USA. Ah, can you feel the magic? We got monorails, boats, and I'm sure a train will pull in soon. Maybe we'll go on a little train ride today. Crowds have been light, so staying very optimistic on getting on some rides. We'll go over here. Oh, look at this, open right up for me. <laughs> Woo, have a great day. The new 100 outside of the parks now. Dun, 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 dun. I'm pumped to be here with all of you. Feels so nice. There's magic in the air. City Hall looking good. You know what I like doing? We're not gonna jump on the first track because we're gonna walk down Main Street, but. Sometimes you just gotta take it in. Oh, never mind. There's a VIP area blocked off. But I was gonna just stand up here. Most of the time you gotta stand up here and look down Main Street.
But that's still a fun reveal right there. It's a beautiful day. What's up? Nice to meet you. Max, nice to meet you too. Where are you from? I'm from New York. What part? Uh, Queens, Astoria. Oh, nice. We love Astoria. Shout out to Queens, New York. Oh, yeah. It's great to see you. Same here. You get, you're hanging out here all day? Not all day. We're going to be a little break. Though. Yeah, um, it's going to be a hot one. Oh, yeah. Um, so, we've been here for about three days now. Oh, awesome. Um, we're going to head back to the resort a little bit and then um, possibly just come back. I love it. Great plan. I'm glad you came up and said hi, though. It was awesome, awesome. seeing you, dude. Awesome you. Yeah. Have, Have a good one. Yeah, and more New Yorkers in the house. Great to see Max. If you guys are ever uh, around, come up and say hi. Love meeting people. Here's Roy and Minnie. And then you can see Roy's window is the center window right up top. Right there, Roy O. Disney. Looks like we may have a uh, parade or cavalcade coming soon. <laughs> Being blocked in by the ropes. Kingdom. Here's the Festival of Fantasy Parade. We're gonna have a nice view of a nice clear Main Street and then get pushed to the side. Here we go. If you are just joining us, we are at the Magic Kingdom here at Walt Disney World in Orlando, Florida. It's a beautiful day here. Hot, but beautiful. We're going to cut through the air conditioning because that sidewalk was crowded. And then, hey, who wants to say no to some air conditioning when it's 90 degrees outside? Here's some of the new T-shirts. We're going to cut through Casey's and see if we can get a good spot for the parade and start this off with a little festival of fantasy. So when the marshal comes down, which just came down when you, we, it's like the unofficial start of the parade. That's usually like your five, 10 minute warning to go get a good spot, which my favorite spot is over in Frontierland. Da, da, da. Bum, 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 bum. I also have to make one little stop in Adventureland quickly. I'll show you, uh, let's play this really quick. If you saw our Ted Lasso show we were talking about earlier, but uh, I think it's the second one, you would have seen this over here. They got the little uh, dam set up to block the water as they're going to be taking off some of the 50th decorations that are on the castle. So they stop the water here and on the other side, that way they can get the uh, lifts in there and the Construction workers can do their thing. Spring rolls, one of my favorite snacks here at the Magic Kingdom. I recommend trying both, there's a combo. 
They used to have the 50th, but now that it's over, they have the pastrami and pepper jack spring rolls, uh, which comes with a mustard dipping sauce. And then also you have the cheeseburger spring rolls. Both are delicious. Adventure. The 50th statues are still here. You can see a boo holding that 50th. I think we'll see those for a while. I'm gonna set you guys up right over here for a sec. I just have to take care of one little thing, I'll let you do some people watching, and I will be right back. We're back. So you can see the parade still hasn't started when you look down that walkway. So we're gonna go down this way. Also, if this is very crowded when you're here on your vacations, say you're here during the summer or busier months, this little walkway has been clutch. Cause it's one, in the shade, and two, it's got all these little bench cutouts where you just take a load off, put your bag down or beverage down, whatever you got going on. Spinning camel, still working, but this ride's still down. Carpets haven't been running for a little bit. I know what you're thinking, how bizarre. I'd have to agree. <laughs> this is where you would normally meet Aladdin or Jasmine. And now, I think we're gonna see the very beginning. There's the first float. Dun, 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 dun. And this is my spot right here on this box. It's the best. Festival of fans. I'm gonna jump up here. I don't wanna block you. Over here.
Captain Hook. And Tink on the back of the float. Smee trying to catch up. There's the fire. We got fire here. Congratulations, he's defeated the dragon. You can feel that heat from here. Wee! Isn't this swell? M I C K E Y M O U S E. Donald Doug. Yes, it is, Minnie.
Another little hack, if your family's up here watching, you're having a long day, some nice benches here. Another way you can tell it's light crowds, you can still walk behind the crowd. Normally this is packed out. to see Thank you for your service. <laughs> he was the claw, get it? The claw. Let's head this way. We're in Liberty Square right now. They just unboarded the Liberty Bell, which is the Liberty Square Riverboat. Yeah, if you want to know crowd sizes, look how empty this is over here. And it is lunchtime. It's 12, 20. If anyone knows the whole Paul Revere story of America, right there, that's the window if you're standing over here. One if I land, two if I see, there's the two lanterns. Haunted Mansion's 20 minutes. We will come back later, God bless you. Happy birthday. And a first visit. What a magical birthday. And now we cross from Liberty Square to Fantasyland. And there's no restrooms in Liberty Square to stay too true to the times. So now if you need to go to the restroom, there's what we call Puntel's Poopers. <laughs> the tangled bathrooms. And if you didn't know, there's a scavenger hunt here. You can find all the Pascals. And I believe there's one hiding out right down here. They're very hard to find. You see Pascal blending in right there. Super tough. If you're enjoying our stream today here at the Magic Kingdom, please hit that like button. It helps. It's not hard. Nothing happens but a smile on my face. So, you know, you could gently tap it, go ahead and smash it. But hitting that like or that thumbs up is just delightful. If you're going way back, way, way back, these bathrooms used to be where the Skyway, the old buckets in the sky would come in. They go from here to Tomorrowland and they turn these into the bathrooms and the Tomorrowland bathrooms that are behind the stage was the other station. Small World, five minutes, should we do Small World? We haven't done this in forever. 
Let's do it. Why not? I mean, I don't know if it's five minutes now, because just about 100 people walked on, but it'll give me some time to catch up with the chat. This ride's iconic. And I couldn't even tell you the last time we did this on a stream. Let's see how true to five minutes it is. And go. Are you gonna be right you need the scooter to go in? You can park it on the But the air conditioning feels quite nice. A lot of high fives. I'm gonna say this is just a, a hair more than five minutes. I'm gonna say it's gonna take eight minutes. We're 50 seconds in. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Maybe we can hit 100 likes before we get off. It's a small world. What do you say? Shout out to all the lurkers out there. But if you are chatting, I will be saying hi to everyone in about two seconds. As soon as the line comes to a stop, we'll chat. It's a small world. All righty. Let's see what I missed here. Oh, that's awesome. Dawn said she went on this with some of the ABC gang last month. That's so much fun. If you guys missed it, we had an amazing time at our meetup. Uh, it was the weekend of Animal Kingdom's 25th anniversary. We all got together. I shouldn't say we all, but it was really nice. We had around 50 people in town, seeing so many people, meeting so many people, putting faces to names, and just hanging out. And then I love like all the little groups and people that became new friends. And now we have this community and it's just so great. We'll be doing more. Big shout out again to uh, Dawn and Brandy who did so much work for that meetup. Also Bill and Lynette. Uh, just so lucky to have so many awesome people in this community. And if you wanna come hang out, a good way to start, jump on our Discord. Link is down below. TLOS says, good morning from Los Angeles. Great to see you in the Magic Kingdom, Pete. Thanks so much. <laughs> it's, a, it's a peak world after all. I'm not, no, definitely not. But it's definitely a small world. Dis our dream. Good afternoon. Great to see you. Farris Films is in the house. He says, everyone like, comment, subscribe. Love you, Pete. Miss you. See you soon. Love you too, buddy. Speaking of potty with Pete, Izzo, uh, in the chat, Izzo wrote potty with Pete. I have uh, ranked... Uh, the bath person and we started to film a potty with Pete series as well So they have the Ted Lasso going on and also the potty with Pete coming behind it. I had to break Epcot into two different uh, videos Because we're gonna do future world and then the front three neighborhoods Because then in each video there's two little mini categories the bathrooms that are on maps and then the what I'm calling, quote unquote, the secret bathrooms, even though they're not a secret, but they're not on the main maps when you enter the park. God bless you. So if you guys want to know which restrooms are the best in the parks, that is coming soon. Make sure you're subscribed. Mr. Lou, what's going on? Great to have you here. Let's go up to where I left off. We were getting off the boat so I can come see who I missed. Great to see Jen P here. Balaban channel in the house. What's going on, Balaban channel? Kristen Marconi is here. Hi, Kristen. Hi, Amanda Evelyn. Such a beautiful day. It is. It's hot, but it's beautiful. Okay. 
It was great to see Max, WW Max, came up, said hi to us when we got into the park. Great seeing Max from Queens. Again, if you're ever here, come up and say hi. I love meeting people. You can ask anybody here. I'm not weird. I'm the same. I'm fun. Jason Meckis, good morning. Or I should say good afternoon now here on the East Coast. Allison, hi, how you doing? Good afternoon. Lynette, thanks so much for reminding everyone to hit the like on your way in. So kind. Robert D over at Universal Islands of Adventure being adventurous. You going? Oh, it's okay. Danny wants to know what's everyone's favorite land at the Magic Kingdom. Oh man, it's hard. It's like choosing children. Low crowds this week. Yeah, with uh, the time between the spring break uh, and the summer are, are very nice. May is usually pretty quiet, and then school here lets out the end of May. Today was actually the last day of seniors for Lauren uh, here in Florida, so you'll see some of the locals start to creep back in towards the end of the month in June, and then June lets out school all over the country. July, very hot. Uh, and busy August the Florida kids go back to school But a lot of the country still off. So yeah, this is a nice month May And it's not super hot yet, but again even like this week. It's 90 degrees every day ish some days are 93 some days are 89 Jokes is oh yes yes yes. Jorge, what's going on? It's this amazing video. Thanks so much. Appreciate you being here. Is oh I love it. So as I slept well last night, my comment batteries are recharged. We love your comments. Jorge says uh, shares the same love for Disney as a 46 year old, and he just came from Disneyland. That's awesome. Izzo saying Adventureland. I mean, this is Adventures by Carney. I feel like I should say that as well. Dawn agrees. Says Pirates Rules. Yeah, just got Disney. Says June through August, the parks will be very busy, especially uh, the week of Memorial Day, which is true. Another reason why it's nice, I mean, we didn't have that we planned this on purpose. It worked out. But again, on our little road trip, Make sure you're subscribed. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're uh, going up and back down the East Coast uh, the first two weeks of June. It's going to be a lot of fun. We'll be putting out videos. I'm going to try to put out videos at least every other day just showing you the adventures. Also, make sure, make sure you're, uh, you're following the socials at Official Carney on Instagram, at your WDW guy on Twitter. Adventures by Carney is the TikTok. It's also the Patreon. It's everything. But... Uh, We'll be posting a bunch of stuff on the socials as well as putting out videos. Like I said, the goal I'm going to try to do every other day and mixing in live videos as well. So make sure you are subscribed and those will be impromptu. Don't know how much notice I might be able to give on the road trip. So I would recommend if you're not already, this is a nice little thing you can do is turn on, uh, hit that bell and hit all notifications. So that way it'll let you know right away if I go live and you won't miss a thing. We don't post all the time or blow up your feed. Nothing like that. Just whenever we're doing a video, that's about it. Angela says, what is October through November like? Isn't that hurricane season? Yes, yeah, so mid-September through mid-October, I'd say, is the craziest for hurricanes, or probably to the end of October now. So mid-September through the beginning of November, hurricane season. But that is really just like rolling the dice because, I mean, it is beautiful here. My favorite months to visit Orlando before I moved here. We're always October, November. Uh, the weather starts to cool off a little bit. The crowds aren't as crazy. Uh, I also like uh, like the fall decor here in the Disney parks. I like HHN over at Universal Studios. But you do have to roll the dice with flights because if you catch one of those one or two uh, rough hurricanes, they can ground flights or cancel flights. And in the last year or two, we've had a few that have caused uh, flights to be canceled. So you are rolling the dice, but it's a great time to be here. 
unless you're able to drive down, then you don't have to worry about flights. Uh, and the safest place to be during a hurricane is actually Disney World. They, these places were built for uh, the worst hurricanes. It's very high, and it's in the middle of Florida, so we're directly in between the two coasts. Uh, even though we live 10 minutes away, we're very lucky. We, we, we don't get hit very hard either, but we've come to Disney for hurricanes because it's an awesome place to be. And they make sure you're safe, and there's, uh, there's, they keep the magic going with characters around. and It's nice. David Lung says, I'll be there mid-September. Can't wait. Angela says, we went early April. Had a total blast. It was rock and roll. Should have planned more time. Uh, would have liked to meet you, Pete. Well, on the next trip. I'm always here. I'm always around. Look at that. We got over 100 people hanging out. Welcome, everybody. We're here in line for It's a Small World. About to get on the ride here. If you could do me a favor, hit that like button. We're uh, only at 85 likes, but we have a over 100 people hanging out with us. Help a guy out. Let's spread some Disney magic. Maybe we'll hit that algorithm just right and spread some love and happiness across the YouTube interwebs. Melissa Wilson, what's going on? Since me and my family will be down to Disney in July. Awesome. Just for your July and August trips, I mean, there's still fun times to come down. And I know especially as somebody who dates a teacher, there's certain months you have to come down or kids are out of school. Is uh, I would plan to, if you can pull this off, I'm not a morning person, but when I'm at Disney, rope drop. Get to the parks an hour before they open. They'll let you in right up to the ropes, uh, and you can get right to the rides you want to do. But you're better off waking up at 6 in the morning and then go until like noon, and then you can go have lunch anywhere you want, either in the park or out of the park or back at your resort. But go back, maybe take a nap, hit the pool in the middle of the day, a nice little refresher and then come back to the parks as it cools down around three or four and you can do all the nighttime activities watch the fireworks and that way you have that energy to last until nine ten o'clock at night and then start again the next day lynette says they're rolling the dice this october yeah i mean it's just a a, a thing right like hopefully there's no really bad hurricanes hopefully there's no hurricanes at all uh but again, if you're here, or once you're here, you are safe. So you don't have to worry about like your safety. It's just the inconvenience of flights being canceled. Jamie is so funny. He says, well, my hubby hates this rabbit. I enjoy it. Lauren refuses to go on this with me. Uh, we were here together the other day. Uh, just to, We were shooting some stuff for shorts, but also just to kind of have a day off camera together. And she refused to go on this with me. I wanted to film a little something on here, and she was like, no. <laughs> yeah, Jorge, not a five-minute wait. What did I say? I forget. What time did we start this again? I had it on my uh, timer. I was using the timer on the video, but now I forgot what time it was when we started. We're close, though. Not too bad. Honestly, anything under 15 minutes at Disney, a home run. Izzo might pop down at the end of September. Love it. Yeah, in our Discord, again, go check out the Discord. The link's down below in the description. Uh, we're going to be starting to plan a little get-together. Nothing crazy, but we'll see what happens. All are welcome. We never charge anything uh, unless, obviously, like, whatever Disney charges. But we just like to meet up with people, you know, grow the community, have fun in our groups, have some meals and whatnot or little special events together. But it looks like we're going to be shooting for around end of September, early October, mid-October-ish. But there's a whole channel dedicated to that in our Discord, so you can go check that out. Look at that! <laughs> we have watchers! Nice! You're on the delay, though, so I'm like, oh, God, I hate the sound of my voice. Thanks for watching, though. Just me. Love it. Thanks. Do you guys want the back? Do you want the back? Okay. It was just snugger, that's what I was asking. Where are you guys from? Vegas. Vegas? Love it! So this, is this just as bad or is Vegas worse right now or is this worse heat-wise? The humidity here is what kills you, right? Yeah, if I'm outside in Vegas, I'm usually in a pool. Otherwise, we're inside seeing a show or eating a meal. All right, here we go. Small world.
<laughs> I love that. Tomorrow the Traveler. If the Scorpions played Garden Rocks, they could play Rockets Like a Hurricane. Yeah, it's food and wine during October, November, too. Well, it's food and wine for like four months now. Here we go. Wow, he just says there's another channel. I think I know who you're talking about. Where they ride the same ride all day for charity and they did Small World 25 times in a row. Yikes. go into the Pinocchio Village House, you could wave to everybody at Small World. They used to have signs. Welcome to the happiest cruise that ever sailed.
<laughs> Are they missing the whole left side of dancers? If we ever lose service or the buffers, just hit refresh. I'm gonna be switching from Wi Fi to cell phone. But we're not going anywhere, so just make sure you hit refresh or check back for the best possible picture.
How is that plate not falling? And think about how much smaller the world is getting every day. What a visionary. This ride debuting at the World's Fair. Over, what is it, over 60 something years now ago. Wild. Joey, what's going on? Joey's in the house. Also, I think Anthony the Molar Man is here. Great to see Anthony. Uh, in the chat, we're discussing how many times until you go insane on this ride. Seems though people are setting the line at 25. If you have to stay awake for all of them, it would be rough. I mean, I could easily just take a snooze. Nice air conditioning, it's so hot outside, a little break, and they'll just sing me to bed. Adios, ciao, douche vedania, widersen, kwaheri, saijan, goodbye, au revoir, shalom, adieu, stokalo, du widzenia, va well, salani kahir. I hope I said at least 50% of those correctly. All right, y'all, guess what? We got a little surprise after this. We have a lightning lane for the Seven Dwarves Mine Train. Oh, 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 oh. Hello, Matthew. Yes, we ever buffer or the screen. Wow, people are excited. Uh, if you ever, the picture goes a little blurry or we buffer or the screen goes gray or black, just hit refresh. I'm not going anywhere until we say goodbye. I brought portable chargers with me. I probably should have charged on that ride, but we, were, we came in with 100%, so we're good for a while. Yeah, nice meeting you guys. Uh, you too. It's a small world after all. It's a small, small world. Oh, this guy's going the other way. <laughs> up, up and away.
right. Back into Fantasyland. Peter Pan's flight right now, it's 60 minutes. Call me crazy, but I think that's a full hour. Philhar Magic's another uh, nice break from the sun if you need a little break. Because around 2 o'clock every day here, it gets a little warm. Well, not just 2 o'clock, all day. But that is around when it's usually the hottest point of the day here. Mm -mm, doo -doo. Happy birthday. If you enjoyed Small World, consider giving a like or subscribing. We'd love to hang out with you more often. Or if you like the stream, maybe you know some family or friends that would enjoy it, share it on out. Have some fun with it. Don't be shy. It is time. We're going mining. Pizza pie. Here we go. All right. So I will tell you, when we go into this queue right here, as soon as we enter this cave, this cavern, this mine, we might lose service for like 30 to 60 seconds. I'm not going anywhere. You got to run and take care of some business at work. Or if you're at home and you got to run out of the room. Or if you're driving and you decide you want to pay attention for a little bit. Now's the time. But we're fresh. We're coming right back. If we lose service, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna keep this thing going. I'm just letting you know we might lose you. It's a good time to subscribe, like. Jordan's over at Hollywood Studios. That's awesome. Hi, Jordan. Congrats on being a new pass holder. She was hanging out a baseline without me. Is oh, that's a great joke. I mean, it's <laughs> Izzo in the chat said, "You hear they might be retheming the mine train to Nemo? Then it's just going to be called the mine, 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 mine train." It's a great joke. I hope I delivered it properly for you. Congrats to Jordan on just graduating last Tuesday. Very exciting stuff. <laughs> Thank you, Izzo. Just happy that the stream is still working, you know? We Also, on this ride, I enjoy the back of the coaster, so that's a win for me. 
I'll tell you, somewhere out front or back. This one, I believe, the further back in the train, the better. Just my opinion, though. I'm going to take you guys out of the